In my journey, I have come to realize that successful weight loss is intentional. Success at anything is intentional. Initially, when I wasn't intentional and conscious about certain things, my journey proved really, really difficult. But then I thought, if you want to go to college or if you want to be successful at anything, you pre-plan and you work towards it. You make sure that you put in the work. You make sure that you study as hard as you can, better than you naturally would in order to make the good grades so you make it into college. When it came to my weight loss journey, I realized I was not putting in the same effort. So I thought, just like I would put in an effort if I was to have an interview for a job, or the way I put in effort when I was about to go to college, or when I was studying for my MBA, they were all intentional successes. I had a starting point and I pre-planned, I strategized and I worked towards my goals in order to make sure that I attained that goal. But when it came to my weight loss journey, I realized that I was complacent and did not put in as much effort that I put in other aspects of my life. And that completely changed the way I viewed my weight loss and my transformation journey, as well as my journey in reversing type two diabetes. Today, we are going to talk about the four things that you need to understand before beginning your weight loss or your transformation journey. It is a journey and everybody's journey is different. So you need to apply techniques that would work for you and fit into your lifestyle. Nobody knows you better than you. Let's dive right in. If you haven't subscribed yet, do well to hit the subscribe button. Hi, I'm Miriam and welcome to Everything Life. The very first thing that I want to talk about is decide to be intentional about being consistent. Consistency helps sustainability. For instance, if it is meal prepping that will help, get good storage space. I personally had to acquire a whole new different refrigerator to help me accomplish this. Implement whatever you need to implement to make the process sustainable for you. Be accountable to someone, not just anybody, but somebody you trust who will encourage you, but at the same time, be honest with you and tell you as it is, if you are falling behind on your progress, because the thing is those days will come and you would want to throw in the towel and give up, but that right person would help keep you going. Don't look back, keep moving forward. Don't worry about what you have not been able to accomplish in the past. Have hope for the days and future ahead. The now is your opportunity to reset. While there is life, there is hope for the future. All you have to do is to get up one day and decide that this is it for me. It is okay for you to start all over if you have tried it before and was unsuccessful at it. When you fall, don't give up rise up and do it again. I always say it is not how many times you fall, but it is how many times you get back up and try again. Rome was not built in a day. The unhealthy habits were not built in a day. The mindset did not happen in a day. The change may take time, but it will be worth it. Always keep moving forward and never backwards. Finally, it is okay if sometimes you give yourself a treat or go off your regimen. In my journey, I have preferred using the word treat and not cheat because cheating just sounds very negative to me. I'm not necessarily cheating myself for giving myself a treat after several days, weeks, possibly months of eating clean. I'm simply treating myself, but I always remember not to go off completely 
because that is when I will be cheating myself. You would be doing yourself a disservice by not staying consistent. If you have to give yourself a little bit of time or a break, do exactly that. Give yourself time. But just remember not to go ballistic with getting off track to the point where you negate your entire progress. When you get off your regimen, for instance, get back on your regimen the day after that and be consistent. Keep going. Don't give up and you will see the results. This is all I have for you today. I hope this information was helpful. If it was, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share, turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. Until next time, remember to be beautiful, be bold, be true to yourself and to others, and always be you.